Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. My name is Amasid and today we are double corrupting 20 Aegis Auroras. A little bit of a tongue twister there. I'd like to thank Corona for providing these for today's video. Let's hope we can do something with them. Now the total cost here was just about 70x for the temples and the shields. I will know all the shields are quite well rolled in terms of their wed as well as their uh, armor and ES. So that should be pretty pretty nice when we hit a good double corrupt and i say when we hit a double corrupt, double corrupt because i am a believer so i am a believer and we're gonna jump right in here in just a second and uh get the corruption underway Alrighty, shield number one we're getting our poofs out of the way early mark my words mark my words no more poofs Alrighty, shield number two Number three, third time lucky. All right, this is the one where we turn it all around. This is unbelievable. This is really unbelievable. Number five, not gonna say anything. See, and there it hits white sockets. It's just that easy. White sockets, I don't know the value, but it's better than a poof, that's for sure. All righty, give me some implicits. This is just getting ridiculous. Here we go. Number seven. Really? Come on. <laughs> number eight. Lucky number eight. White sockets again. I, I'll take it at this point. Number nine. This is just insane. These odds. This is just ridiculous. Number ten. Halfway point. And it bricks, of course. All right, at this point, I'm just expecting a brick or a poof. See them, you're pleasantly surprised when you hit white sockets. Again, we're at number 11 and we still don't have any with implicits. Crazy. Will we break the streak? Will we hit implicits? We will. Fizz taken as lightning and reduce damage to projectiles. I mean, that seems pretty good. Seems pretty good. We'll take a look, but seems pretty good at the at a glance. Can we keep the streak alive? We can! Plus two aura. I imagine that's that's quite nice. Uh, but plus two war cry probably pretty useless. But plus two aura could be quite pretty good. We'll we'll check at the end, but we are on a streak. Check it. Two in a row. Take that. Can we keep it going? We cannot. We cannot. Number fifteen. Aura gems and max block. This could be quite juicy. This could be quite juicy indeed. Number 16. Warcry gems again. It's the third one with Warcry gems, maybe? Second or third one with Warcry gems, but Fizz as fire is quite nice. So, seems pretty good. Number 17. We're on a good streak, so it, it had to end. It had to end. The final three. Boom. Two in a row. Of course. Of course. It's the way. Second to last. Okay. We're on the cold streak, so the last one can be best in slot. It's the way it goes. Last and hopefully not least. Bricked. But we got a bunch of good implicits to walk through, so let's go take a look at those right now. All right, if we are back now, take a look at the results here again, considering the stage of the league that we're in price checking is always a little bit tricky. So take it with a grain of salt, but walking through the results at a high level, we ended up with four with double implicits, three white sockets, six rares, and that means we had seven poofs, which is pretty ridiculous, pretty awful. Um, but let's walk through the pricing here. Overall, I think if everything sells at roughly what I'm seeing. I think it'll probably be just about break even. Now, white sockets, regardless of rolls, and these are quite well rolled, keeping that in mind. Again, look at this one. It's 399 and 19. This is a really, really nicely rolled one. This one, not that great on the on the LA damage with attacks, but really high on the armor. Most of these, that was the trend. High armor, ES, LA damage could go either way. But so call about an X, X and a half on each of these. This one here, so the fizz damage taken is fire, and then similarly. Fizz taken as lightning. Just those mods in general are about two to three X, give or take. Um, this reduced damage taken for projectiles is actually quite nice. And so I could see something being even more there, maybe closer to like the six, seven X range potentially. Um, 
so not bad there this guy here so aura gems by itself so if we just look at aura gems is just about 12x when you but considering these are extremely well rolled this one is 390 and it's a decent roll on the la damage of the tax as well if you care about that um it's probably going to be just closer to more like 18x with the rolls so that's pretty nice and then you have this one which is honestly creme de la creme uh in terms of the the pool of uh, options we're looking at here in front of us so we have aura gems which again is minimum 12x we have maximum chance to block attack damage which is very very nice and then we also have a perfect roll on the armor es so that's really sick and then a very nice wed roll again if you if you if you care about that on when you're using this so really really strong shield I'm seeing anywhere from 30 to 40 X for this shield. This is a really nice hit. Um, I think there are probably better options, but still all things considered quite, quite nice. I mean, aura AOE would probably be really nice. I don't know how much that one is, but I would assume a lot, um, but either way, really, really nice hit. So I think that it really depended on maybe these two, the sales price of these two, uh, it would be about a break even, which is all, which is pretty good. Again, considering we had six rares and seven poofs, 13 out of the 20, uh, turned into something that is useless for us. So I'll take that. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this one and I will catch you in the next one.